it's time to play some more Rhythm Tengoku with Deep Toonster. As you can see, I've managed to perfect that ghost game, as you, you can tell by that heart with the P inside of it. And now we got to try to beat this god dang bunny game. I don't know why I was failing it so much. It's not even a hard game. I'll show you my true power. Hey, 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 hey. All there is to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Keep it up, bunny. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm pumped up to play this, man. I'm waiting to do some Rhythm Tengo Goo. Come on, don't mess up. Stop messing up, bunny. Whoa, I got lag. That's not fair. If I fail this, I'm gonna be mad. Two, three, four. Yeah, there's actually a beat count for when you're in the air. Stop tripping. I have no idea why I'm tripping up. And this game's pretty picky about that, too. Just a couple trip-ups and you're failing. Oh, he passed me. Thank God. Alright, so we can move on finally. Oh, yeah. Attack of the furries, man. They may not look like furries now. Oh, but there they are. So pretty much what you're doing in this game is they'll have those two guys jumping up. And at the height of their jump, for the one on the left, you're hitting a direction on the D-pad. It doesn't matter which one. And when the pink one is at the top of her jump, you're hitting the A button. And if they transform, you'll be doing it right. Alright, I gotta concentrate. I'm doing horrible. How many times I want to say that, this LP? I don't know. I can honestly say the odds of me passing this one right now are very low. Quite low. Do, 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 do. Come on. Get in sync here, man. I failed that. Oh no, he passed me. That one is one of the more lenient ones then. Because in my opinion, I didn't do so good. I would have failed myself. Uh oh. I don't look happy even though I passed. Oh yeah, that's, I forgot to mention those. I've never acknowledged those screens after you finish the game. They actually change depending on how well you did, so the gold is the best you can get. Usually it'll appear pretty sad on the barely passing level, and they'll appear happy on the gold level. This game, it's just a basic copy the other guy game. Copy the other guys, I should say. So you say it's turn right, or turn left. Is it right or left? It's hard to tell in this horrible pronunciation. Ow! Yeah, it's hilarious when you get punched in the face when you do it wrong. So the other things you do is you do this little lunge downward, and you do an actual punch. Like that. Alright, I got it. Okay. And the punch is like this. And you'll see it. Yeah, so you have to wait for the pu -pu -pu punch Yeah, like that. Alright, that's enough of that tutorial. Let's get the show on the road. I'm actually not that good at this minigame, to be honest. I fail a lot, so I'm going to have to concentrate a bit. Punch, yeah. This one shouldn't be so hard, though. For some reason, they like to use this one a lot later in the game. Right or left? I think it's right. Oops, I punched out of nowhere. Isn't this fun, kids? Just doing the same thing for eight beats. The music's all about repetition. Well, the rhythm is anyway. Do, do, do. Yeah. And you'll have that guy calling him out by himself. Ah. Three in a row. Who would have guessed? Of course, it repeats. Down. I don't know what they're saying when you go down. I really don't. Your guess is as good as mine. Or maybe you know it. Bunch. Titsy down. I'm, I'm, I don't know. It sounds like titsy down. Whoa, what? I got lag there. Titsy down. <laughs> Getting punched in the face. Be 
smart after this is over. Punch! Pouch! This one actually goes on for a, lot, a little while. Okay, so we got those glimmer stars in the background, which means we're done. What's he saying? My past. Alright, fair enough. Got their backs turned to the audience. The leaf blowing. Okay. Oh, I got an opportunity to perfect that one. Which I'll do some other time. Probably before I start recording the next video. The third remix. Here already, folks. Dude. Great. Starts with a bunny game. We actually get a song with some lyrics for a change. Of course, you can't understand them. But you know, music is a universal language. You don't need to understand them. Hearts in the background. We'll change that. Punch! Alright. It's weird not doing this to a waltz beat. Ah! See what I mean? Okay. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Alright. Let's keep moving along. Here! Oh, I didn't expect that. Penguins! I kind of concluded after the last video that I love this game. I don't know why. Got some foxes. Ah. So as you can see, it's actually getting a little harder. I'd say this is definitely harder than the past two remix levels. I don't know what that text in the top left is. Probably just credits for the song that's playing. We performed it. Ah! Spinning like a madman up there. GP room. So yeah, I guess it's just a little bit of credits that goes on, but we're not even close to being finished with all these games. And we got through it. What the hell is that supposed to be? What does that have anything to do with what I just did? Nothing. That's what. Uh, this next game is kind of weird. It's a lot different from how the other games operate. Uh, pretty much what it is is... What the hell? Do suns? Or have question marks in there? I'm not even going to ask. This is from Japan. Why even ask? So what you're doing is... This guy will do a certain number of beats with those buttons that you see. And I'm talking about the blue guy here. And what you have to do is just match up the number of beats. So it's kind of like a quote, guessing game. It's not really a guessing game, because if you're doing it right, you'll know how many beats he did. You just gotta follow the rhythm pat pattern that he does. So, here we go. Here's an example for you. Alright, so we just do three beats, because all he did was three beats. And you, don't need, you don't have to do it in the, you know, the same rhythm that he did. But later on, you'll pretty much have to, or else you won't be able to get all the beats in in time. Because you saw I had a timer in the middle there. And yeah, I got it right. It wasn't that hard. Skipping the tutorial now and getting into the real game. Hopefully I'll be able to do this. Okay. Alright. Ah. Uh, okay, I had to listen there. Sorry for not talking. I think that's right. So yeah, if you get one, if you're one beat off, you fail this game automatically. So you really have to be listening. So you have to par pardon me if I'm not that interesting while he's doing his thing. Yeah, I got that one right. Okay, and he does some random beats after he does the regular rhythmic t pattern too. So you got to pay attention to that as well. Okay, one beat at the end. Okay. I think that's right. Hopefully. Oh god, please be 29. Yes. Yes. Alright. Oh boy. Alright. It's a good thing I was a percussionist in my band, dude. I recognize some of these. Oh 
Oh no, I did 1B over. Cut, 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 cut. Ah, I did not mean to do that last beat at the end there. Ah, jeez. Jeez, guys. I totally failed. Oh. I still passed, though. That's... I don't know. So if you get the first two, you're good, I guess. Thank God. Alright. So this is very similar to that rabbit game I was playing earlier. You're pretty much just jumping to a regular 4-4 beat. And it's kind of like a platform if you think about it, because there's these pits you have to jump over. And the music's kind of nice. It's nice to look at. You got hearts and peppermint plants. Okay, that doesn't make any sense, but still, it's a nice thing to look at. stars twinkling in the background. I'm not going to try this, but I think you can just keep walking on the platform and not worry about falling at all, but maybe those things in the middle, in between the blocks, fall on you, but I'm not sure. The important thing is to jump over those gap. You know what? I'm going to try it. I don't even know if those counted against me. Oh well. Who cares? It's a simple game. Don't think too hard about it. Oh yeah. Anyone thinking about Mario right now? Starman? So yeah, it's nice that you give you this after that freaking match the rhythm level. There was an umbrella on that one. It must be that the type of plant that grows depends on what kind of how accurate you are, or maybe just the type of note you're hitting. Probably the latter. Yeah, when a snare hits, you always get those peppermint things, it seems. So that's the end. You float up to the sky and take your place in heaven. Rhythm heaven, that is. Okay. Yeah, I did really good on that one. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Oh, is this the one I think it is? Dear God. I'm at 52 rhythm rate. Oh, no. This isn't the one I thought it was. But this one's pretty cool, actually. Some epic writing, I gotta say that. I'm actually gonna... That's the basic uh, thing you do. You hit A when he get, does that... Sound like he's taking a crap. Oh, I missed that one. That's the one I need to practice on. Yeah, so that one's a little bit shorter. So yeah, that was basically the tutorial right there. Just giving you those two notes. It's basically just watching this hand draw these Japanese characters out gives you the cue like that. You just help him along his path. Ooh. Alright. Oh. Because you know calligraphy is an art, man. An art I would never achieve at. I mean, my handwriting in English is horrible. You should see it. I say I'll write a lot. Eh, you'll have to forgive me for that. Okay. Ah! I, I can't get that second type of stroke right. <laughs> I said stroke. Okay. <laughs> I thought I did it right that time. And I'm not even doing the regular... Oh, jeez. Timing is really picky. I think I'm just missing something here. I like the guy's dancing off to the side to try to distract you. Oh my god. I'm gonna fail this, guys. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna end this video too with me failing. Isn't that great? What's this? This is a really complex one. It's a face. It's Elvis, man. At least that's what it looks like to me. The end. That's what that means. I'm sorry for not giving you guys a good show. I suck at hand rating, man. Uh, yeah. Saw that coming. Alright, guys. We're going to pick this off in the next video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.